since my eight years I'm, I've been drawing, I've been always been busy with art uh, in a hobby way and later become automatically my profession somehow, but I abandoned for a while and uh, in those few years where I abandoned, that was shortly after my academy period, I uh, did not want to have anything to do anymore with the making of an art object and so I started collecting photography which I found in books and here and there and uh, from those few years of inactivity uh, in fact grew my ideas to um, work with film but starting from photography and so I'm, I've started as a complete autodidact in uh, the sense that I uh, n was never trained as a photographer, neither as a filmmaker. And I think you can, you can somehow still sense that I, in my work, that I have had a training as a painter because composition and light, those classical uh, uh, forms of art or uh, ingredients of art have um, still remained in my work. For me, uh, time in my work is a triangle. The three aspects of the past, the present and the future are together. And so they are somehow suspended in my work and they are, I like to try to unite them on one surface. So it's a way of determining on one hand that a period in time is closed off, but that another part of life is ongoing. And when those two meet, there's a clear border and where it becomes unclear is the position of the spectator himself or the person who's actually watching the piece is partly watching a piece that's a photograph and partly watching a piece that's present tense, that's in the now. And so the, the real uh, mediator between the past and the present there is the spectator. But of course on the surface it appears that there is a certain melancholy and maybe as you say also uh, a sorrow, but in fact, um, I think I'd like to see the story of my work as a happy story. I used to uh, have a game, which I still play, which is to live with one picture at a time for a long time and alter the associations that you make with the picture. It's a very simple exercise. And then later on I started applying uh, this sort of plural interpretations of a single image into my video pieces and is the spectator therefore I think is very often inclined to walk away sort of uninterested and that topic of being uninterested is something that I love I look for that in order to show time you also need to give availability to it and you also need to be able to take time and that's the difficulty I'm afraid I could not define beauty because at each time when I would try to define beauty I would define one single element of beauty and I think what characterizes beauty in itself is that it's a pool of things together that are beautiful because they are, can exist together and because they can coexist something ugly is something that cannot coexist with something else. So it's another definition of war and beauty, if you like, but I think it's also part of the definition of what beauty is when it becomes poetry. When you single out one element, uninteresting. When you let the different elements that are together exist, when you can articulate that, then you get something that's beautiful. In fact, what you get today is a redefinition of all those individual media what is photography, what is sound, what is cinema, what is visual arts, what is painting um, but they, they, they keep their own territories but it, except they, come, they appear on the same platform they appear either on the internet or they might film, cinema might appear in an exhibition space an exhibition will never appear in cinema. So, in fact, the gallery space or the, the museum space is this ideal white or black box or what is ideal empty box um, which provides for oxygen, which provides for space for what I genuinely believe are the arts that are starting to 
um, intermingle. The limit that I set for myself is that I do not want to make sculpture. I do not think of my work as video sculpture. I think that is a topic that has been explored and that has in fact been abandoned. And I have myself abandoned it. So I do uh, see my work as a, a, a certain form of a democratic uh, distribution medium where I exhibit very often in many places and I do not like to see my work as being in the exclusive realm of sculpture um, tough to install uh, complicated technological wise my productions are rather complicated technological wise but my, the, the way I uh, try to exhibit them is fairly simple and fairly straightforward